Meteorologist Mike Taylor here for WBKB11.com. Thank you for logging on. You'll find that the cooler air is starting to really start to pull in, and that's going to be the forecast scenario for our Tuesday. Therefore, our temperatures, they're going to be pretty cool. Now, we have the rain showers moving in right now. That's going to start to taper off as we get into Tuesday, but we could have isolated showers. But the temps, they're definitely going to tumble. It'll be chilly outside, especially in the evening time. And then more rain is also starting to target our forecast. Putting that into a perspective, here's all the rain that we're starting to deal with right now. Who's responsible? It's this cold front that's moving through, bringing a lot, lot of cool air behind it. And that's what's going to make our temps really tumble. We're going to cool down a lot, have temperatures well into the 30s during the evening time, especially with this high pressure starting to build in right behind it. That'll clear our skies out with an, an additional amount of cool air that we're going to receive. Isolated showers that we could pick up and then a cloud cover starts to roll through as well. And then as we get into Wednesday and Thursday, well, that's when more cloud cover starts to arrive and also more showers. So it's going to be one of those days that'll be relatively cool, getting constant northwesterly feet of, uh, feet of air coming from Canada. And aside from that, we'll also get the potential for those showers. So overnight, this is exactly what I'm talking about. 36 degrees, mostly clear, scattered showers, winds from the northwest at around 10 to 15 miles an hour. And if we look at the forecast scenario for Tuesday, it will be mostly cloudy and breezy, pushing those cool temperatures against you. Temps are going to range roughly in the 50s for just about everyone, and we'll struggle to even reach that. For tomorrow, mostly sunny in some areas. Winds will be from the north and northwest at 21 knots, so it will be choppy and you're gonna have to deal with those waves at five to six. Now looking at the seven day forecast, much of the same as we experienced today, at least now through Saturday.